Hey kids, Inverted Cal here. Welcome back to The Long Dark. Um, it's actually been several in-game days since I finished the last episode. Um, I went back and picked up that uh, wolf that attacked me on the train tracks and while I was visiting that wolf, another came out to decide to say hi. So I shot it, and took it home, and cooked it, and ate it. Get in my belly. It's done. Okay. Uh, so here's where we're at. <clears throat> we have pretty much explored everything in the Mystery Lake region. Um, we have... I Basically, I have crafted and fixed up everything. So... Um, I'm gonna head back to game. Uh, currently, I've just I've got a little fire going. I've just been taking care of some stuff, but I'm down to a very little amount of food left. Um, overall, I've got essentially this for food: uh, some coffee, herbal tea, a couple of candy or one candy bar. Tin of peaches, tin of pork and beans, two things of milk, and a can of dog food. That's not going to last me long. Now here's the thing: is I've got, I'm just waiting for this gut to cure, this hide to cure, and these last two wolf pelts to cure. Um, which basically means I got about two in-game days, and they're done. I have enough wolf pelts here to make the coat. Um, so I'm going to do that before I head to the next level or the next area. I mended all my clothes and I broke down everything that I didn't need. Um, if I can figure out how to walk here. There we go. I have. Uh, a spare set of shoes, a spare heavy wool sweater, a spare toque, uh, and spare pair of socks. I have two simple arrows and a bow, and I made uh, the, all those things into arrow shafts, all the saplings that I picked up into arrow shafts. Um, I also made a stack of hooks from some scrap metal, and I made one fishing tackle. Um, everything else I broke down and used for repairing. Um, I have enough deer hide. The reason I don't have any jeans or any pants is I have enough deer hide that when this one has done curing, uh, I can make the deer skin pants. Um, where are they? Deer skin pants. I can do these, uh, which is what I want to do. Now that's 25 hours, that's a full day of crafting to make these. And when those two wolf hides are done, that's another full day of crafting to make this wolf skin coat. Um, I'm going to make both of those before I transition to the next area. The, the problem is, right now, is I'm out of food and I have run out of stuff to do inside the cabin. You know, basically he's looked at all the porn he's going to look at. He's done all the things he's going to do. So I'm thinking... If this doesn't start up another uh, blizzard here, I'll be fine. I'm going to grab the second... No blizzards! Bad. Uh, I'm going to grab the second um, road flare and dump off some of this junk here that I don't need. Oh, I crafted up an extra bunch of bandages so that they're, uh, there's actually half a dozen old man's beard bandages ready. So I'm going to dump two of those and two of these. Okay. Um, I have a hatchet, 
Oh, I sharpened up a hatchet and a knife almost fully. Cleaned the rifle again. Um, pretty much everything has been brought up to snuff. Um, so I'm going to drop this because I don't want to take this with me right now. It sounds like it's storming. I really, really hope it isn't. But here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to go and take care of the occupant at the dam. Um, or not. Seriously, uh, game, that is getting to be a little bit annoying. Okay, you walk out your door and you are attacked by a wolf. I realize that it's part of the story that the wolves don't normally do that, but at the same time, really, beginning to get flipping annoying. Alright, well, where'd you go? Stupid dog. Like, seriously? So many wolves per game, per map, and the respawn on them should be very, uh, fairly minimal. Um, I shouldn't have to kill 20 or 30 wolves just to kind of get around on a map. And then that one ran away. Oh, is that his carcass there? No, that's a deer carcass. Okay, now why is this doing it differently? Because he's not frozen. Okay. No idea where that last wolf went to though. I think that was the one that I put two pot shots between his ears. Um, just doesn't learn. Uh, 
Well, it's, it shows you how quickly the game can change your plans. So now I'm going to hobble this idiot back here. Deal with the fact that he's cold yet again. going. Since we just harvested that deer, we're just going to cook that thing right up. We'll be back as soon as it's cooked here. All right, kids, we're back. Um, cooked up that meat and got ourselves a bit of a nap. Healed up a bit from that idiot dog attacking us. Um, So, let's say we make another attempt to try it again. Because it sounds like it's still storming out there, no matter what we do. Hopefully we can make it to the dam without being attacked by another stupid dog. Or better yet, we'll see that sorry idiot thing dead on the street here somewhere. Alright, we're going to make another attempt to go to the dam. Run, dear, run. Okay, now hopefully we can do this without getting too much trouble.
They provide you pretty much with everything you need to do this fairly easily. Um, a little bit of raw meat. That deer hide is now going to get me a second pair of, or a pair of um, boots. That's the word I'm looking for. Now what we're going to try to do today is actually transfer everything over to this location. However, once I go through this door, we will trigger what is affectionately referred to as fluffy.